welcome to our autocad channel today we are going to do knurling or diamond edge cutting on a cylinder surface so let's start first let's draw a circle of radius 10 you can draw any radius as given in your project so now after drawing the circle we need to draw the polygon number of sides 4 inscribed in circle I am here giving the arbitrary height but you can give the height according to your project work now let's move this to the circumference of the circle now helix command taking the helix radius as the radius of the circle now for turns type t enter give the number of turns as 0.19 and height of 20 now let's extrude the circle to height 20 mm now Sweep command, select the sweeping object, press enter, now selecting the sweep path, now from custom view to front view, we need to mirror this object, selecting this object, typing M I enter, mirroring it. Now. Going to the top view, selecting these two, typing array command, go to polar, select the center point from items. You can give any number of items, here I will give 40. So now again, you can see our object look like this. So first click on this and type explode. Now click on this cylinder, then right click, then go to isolate, hide object. Now selecting this, type group command, now again right click, isolate, end object isolation, now by using subtract command we will subtract this, so first selecting the cylinder, right clicking outside, now selecting this, right clicking outside it may take some time because we are subtracting total 80 objects here you can see our object is ready changing it from 2d wireframe to realistic So here our diamond cutting or knurling is done. Thank you. For more interesting facts, please subscribe our channel.